Jack Rose Dryden coming at you again today with the next episode of the Daily Slab. It is cold. I know it's sunny, but it's cold. 36. Wind chills 30 degrees. I don't know what I'm doing. But I got to get out there and ride today. So this felt right. And uh, so I'm on my bike freezing. But hey, it's supposed to be 65 and sunny this afternoon, so it should be worth it. I hope your day is going great. I wanted to talk a little bit just about riding in general. I love to ride. Absolutely. Hey, there's another bike. I absolutely love to ride. It is by far my favorite pastime. I like to do other things too. I love going to the shooting range and shooting guns. I love, uh, uh, I, I, I like to draw. I like to I like to shoot video, take photographs. But I love to ride. Um, there's something about riding that it's, it's very difficult to explain to someone who's never ridden before. But I'll do my best here. When you deal with stress all day long, I'm a, a computer developer and a technology director by trade. So at any given time, my mind's going a thousand miles an hour and I'm usually being pulled 30 different directions with everybody needing support or needing help or everyone's emergency that they should have planned for so it wouldn't have been an emergency. So when I leave work, uh, a lot of times my stress level is, is very high and there is something about being able to throw my leg over my bike, fire that big old Milwaukee 8 up, hear that rumble, feel that rumble, and then to roll that throttle and take off and go, feel the wind against your head, the power of the bike, and it, it's hard to explain but it's like you just lose yourself in the, in the ride. Uh, it's literally just you, the bike, and the road. And there is something so therapeutic about that. Uh, it just, you, you can just feel the stress wash away. Uh, during the winter time when I'm unable to ride, uh, I miss it so much. Uh, I miss being able to have that stress relief. And so as soon as the weather breaks even a little, I'm out of my bike. Um, it, it is an experience like no other. Uh, I've done, I'm not done on like hundreds and hundreds of things, but I've done quite a few things that are very, very interesting. And, uh, you know, I've done some major hiking trips and uh, seen some absolutely beautiful country. And, and, and those are all great stress relievers in and of themselves but the joy of riding the bike to one of those destinations far outweighs anything else for me when you're riding a motorcycle all you have to do is think about riding that motorcycle in fact that's all you really need to do I mean even I've hesitated even to do any vlogging while I ride but I can typically do that uh, it's no different than talking to someone in a car. And, but when you're riding, you're just, you're focusing on keeping the bike positioned correctly, staying in the lane that you've chosen, riding through your curves, watching for debris or obstacles in the road, watching the traffic patterns. Your head is always up, you're looking, you're looking forward. And there's something to be said for that. I think just the motions and the mechanics of motorcycle riding lend itself to lifting your spirits because your head's up. Your head has to be up. It has to be up to see where you're going. You have to be in the moment to ride a motorcycle. You can't daydream and just go off into la-la land. You have to be in the moment. Uh, and, and so it forces our bodies to function as they're intended to function. Um, and just the feeling of being on a bike the freedom of it. I know there's a danger element to it, which is appealing to some extent. The freedom of being on a bike far outweighs the risk.
best, at least for me. Now that's a personal decision that everyone has to make, but for me, the risks are far outweighed by the benefits. So, I just wanted to talk to you a little bit about that today. Let me know what your thoughts are and your comments are on that. Okay, everyone. That's going to wrap it up for this episode of The Daily Slab. I hope you have a wonderful day. Uh, it's going to be beautiful here in Michigan. And I hope that your day is beautiful as well, even if your clouds are overcast and cloudy. I hope that you find something in your day that makes it beautiful. And I hope that you're able to do something awesome today. Uh, look for that opportunity. Look for that opportunity to move forward. Face your challenges to live your dreams. For those of you who ride, that opportunity to get on a motorcycle and ride. Even if it's only for a few minutes. Take a little bit of your lunch break, go out and ride. Just relax today. Have fun. Enjoy life. You're breathing. That's something to be thankful for. Every day we should be thankful for that opportunity to take a breath and to face another day. So I encourage each of you to face it with courage and to go out and seize your opportunities today. I hope you all have a great day and we will talk to you in the next episode.